Now moving on, an unmanned aerial vehicle belonging to the Northern Air Force has crashed in the Igembe Lokigem area of Kaduna State. Now locals had earlier said it was a helicopter crash that took place in the early hours of Monday at Taime Village uh, near Rigachikum. Now the community uh, is very close to the headquarters of the Nigerian Air Force Air Training Centre Monday. But in a statement, the spokesman of the Nigerian Air Force Edward Gabbard said it was a UAV and not a helicopter as Ella believed. He said enough unmanned aerial vehicle were uh, experienced a uh, mishap after taking off for a mission at a location near Rumja village and about 15 kilometers from base. Since it is an unmanned vehicle, there were no casualties on board or on the ground. It was uh, an early morning uh, opportunity uh, uh, you know, patrol uh, to see if uh, we could get a hold of some of these uh, criminals that have continued to make life unbearable for our people. And then this sad incident happened. Uh, it's sad on one hand, but at the same time, it doesn't change anything for us because uh, our operations we continue. As a matter of fact, uh, it wasn't just a single UAV that uh, took off from uh, base at that point. So the rest continued their operations and they, 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 they went on to do the needful. Uh, it was just this one single and uh, UAV that had this uh, uh, mishap. Uh, so we are trying to make sure that we get to the bottom of it. Uh, we're working with uh, equipment manufacturers too to see how we can really, really understand what happened and then we move on. Uh, period. That was just it. Uh, the, the, the notion that uh, we will continue to Having uh, to be having air operations and uh, not experience a mishap should should be dispelled because once you are very active and I keep on saying that once you have an active air force like Nigerian Air Force, you will spend more time in the air because you have the platforms and because you spend so much time flying, there are, there are going to be likelihoods of mishaps. What we continually pray for is that when we have this kind of accidents, let no lives be lost. We don't want to lose our lives. We don't want to lose uh, innocent civilians. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.